Hey guys, this is another video and a quick mini series my brother and I are making about how to streamline your Instagram work to grow faster on Instagram with less effort and to make more money on Instagram. And in this video, I'll be showing you a huge tip that I use all the time, and that is how to post on Instagram from your laptop or from your desktop. So it's actually really easy to do. It doesn't require any kind of weird hackish coding or anything. It's just a hidden button most people don't know even exists. So when you hop over on Instagram right here, you'll see there is nowhere to hit post. There's no you know upload or post button or anything like that. And honestly, I like to edit my photos on a laptop. I think you know you're more effective when you're editing on a bigger screen. You have more powerful tools like Photoshop or Lightroom. Uh, so whatever nature photos you have or anything, if there's like a weird sign in the picture, you don't want it there, just Photoshop it out. Really easy to do. And you can upgrade the quality of your pictures dramatically uh, just by using your laptop. So with that being said, how do you actually post on here? So what you want to do is the first thing is open up. I use Google Chrome. You can use other browsers. But for this video, it's easiest if you follow along with Google Chrome. So you go up to the top right and you click the three dots right there and it brings up a menu. And then from the menu, you want to go down to settings or no, you go to more tools. Sorry, you go to more tools uh, and go down to developer tools. Now, develop developer tools will open up a really intimidating, you know, on the side, you just gets all this code and stuff. Don't worry about that. What you want to do is go up to the top little, you know, it's kind of blue button right here. It says toggle device toolbar. Make sure you click on that because what that does is it toggles between website mode right there as you see, click on it again, and in, when it's thin like that, you are in mobile website mode. So you wanna make sure that you're doing this in mobile mode and once you get into mobile mode, it looks a little bit closer to what we want. It's kind of looking like your phone, but things are all weird. The Instagram logo's cut off. You got kind of a weird little bar at the bottom. Uh, like it's kind of just no one knows what's going on right here. So what you want to do is hit the refresh button then, and then this will bring you into the mobile mode. Now, once you have that, you'll see this is exactly like your phone. You can go down to the bottom, click upload. This is my personal account. I'm not like trying to grow this one or anything. So. Uh, I'm not actually going to post anything on there right now, but you get the idea of where you can upload a picture from there. And once you upload it, it's going to take you through the exact th same thing that your phone normally does where you can edit on there. But hopefully you already did your editing on your laptop. Um, but, you know, if not, you can edit on there again. And I'm sure you know to do once you get to that point. So, guys, that's how you upload a picture from your laptop or from your desktop on Instagram. I hope you liked this video. If you did, make sure you go down and like and subscribe and check out the next video or the first video in my quick mini series. I'll, I'll put them. I'll put them right there. There's there's the next one. And there is the first video of the mini series. Make sure you check them out if you're trying to grow on Instagram or anywhere online. These are very important tips that my brother and I have learned, you know, over the past few years of growing our Instagram accounts. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time.